isn't it fitting Hall of Fame officials would come to Las Vegas to make today's announcement. Agassi's legacy will be his school's. These children's lives are more important than winning a tennis tournament. You know, there's no question about it in my mind. But unless I won that tennis tournament, I wouldn't be able to help change these children's lives. So I'm, I'm grateful for the sport. Over 600 kids are now benefiting from his tennis legacy. Thousands more will enjoy success because of Agassi's success. We can talk about Grand Slams and Olympic gold medals and all those things. But those people who've decided to use the platform, that they work so hard to achieve, but then take part of that platform and improve the lives of people. That's the big challenge, you know, Andre's really thrown out there to athletes. He's one of the greatest tennis players of his era, certainly the most colorful. His election into the hall is a no-brainer. His induction in July will be a crowning achievement, something he'll share with those he cares most for. Probably my son and my daughter. My son got to see me play, and occasionally on the tennis channel they'll have the classics, and and, and I'll, yeah, and he'll, he'll figure it out. But I'd say those, those two... Uh, I would love to have there. And then as far as uh, the rest goes, I would say my wife and my trainer, uh, Gil, because, you know, those two um, have, have literally uh, saved my life. His family will share the moment in Newport, Rhode Island this summer. His extended family will be here, cheering and rooting for his success, because when Agassi wins, so do they. It's just five years since he's officially retired from the tour. But a long time ago, 25 years ago, Arthur Ashe was inducted into the Tennis Hall of Fame. And they said nobody would ever achieve what Arthur did on the court and off the court. Well, if Arthur was here today, he'd say, I met my match. Chris Matthews, 8 Sports Now.